In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. This is Father Deacon Angel Palacios from the Orthodox Church in America, Diocese of Mexico. From the Mission of St. Andrew in Tijuana, Baja California, Mexico. Today's Gospel is for the 12th of September, 2018, according to St. Luke. Blessed are you who are poor. Raising his eyes towards his disciples, Jesus said, Blessed are you who are poor, for the kingdom of God is yours. Blessed are you who are now hungry, for you will be satisfied. Blessed are you who are now weeping, for you will laugh. Blessed are you when people hate you, and when they exclude and insult you, and denounce your name as evil on account of the Son of Man. Rejoice and leap for joy on that day. Behold, your reward will be great in heaven, for their ancestors treated the prophets in the same way. But woe to you who are rich, for you have received your consolation. Woe to you who are filled now, for you will be hungry. Woe to you who laugh now, for you will grieve and weep. Woe to you when all speak well of you, for their ancestors treated the false prophets in this way. Glory be to thee, O God, glory be to thee. Woo. Blessed are those who are pure, blessed you who are pure. Before God, we all are poor. Blessed are you who are poor. Before God, we all are poor. But sometimes arrogant haughtiness will drive us mad. And then we will believe that we are like God, that we are in grace, that we don't sin. How good it is to know ourselves to be sinners, needing always the salvation that comes from God, and not being Pharisees, believing that we are good. How sad it is to hear those woes to the ones that are rich. Supposedly, when you enter into religion, you are to renounce your wealth. In the orthodoxy, we who are married and also clergy have to work by our own means to sustain our families. How sad it is to see people that will not work and yet have beautiful mansions, have beautiful cars, very expensive uh, wardrobes. They are rich. They have banquets every day. They get upset if somebody does not reckon them with their dignity. How, how sad it is to see clergy people like that. As for us, blessed are the poor. May the Lord shine His face, the light of His face on all of us, that we might find what is faithful and true.